Here the Mississippi carved its mud-dark path, a graveyard for skeletons of sunken river boats. Here the river changed its course, turning away from the city as one turns, forgetting from the past the abandoned bluffs, land sloping up above the river's bend. Where now the Yazoo fills the Mississippi's empty bed. Here the dead stand up in stone, white, marble on Confederate Avenue. I stand on ground once hollowed by a web of caves. They must have seemed like catacombs in 1863 to the woman sitting in her parlor, candlelit, underground. I can see her, listening to shells explode, writing herself into history, asking, what is to become of all the living things in this place? The whole city is a grave. Every spring, pilgrimage, the living come to mingle with the dead, brush against their cold shoulders in the long hallways, listen all night to their silence and indifference, relive their dying on the green battlefield. At the museum, we marvel at their clothes, preserved under glass, so much smaller than our own, as if those who wore them were only children. We sleep in their beds, the old mansions hunkered on the bluffs, draped in flowers, funeral, a blur of petals against the river's gray. The brochure in my room says this, living history, the brass plate on the door reads, Prissy's room. A window frames, the rivers crawl toward the gulf. In my dream, the ghost of history lies down beside me, rolls over, pins me beneath a heavy arm.